Hello everyone, another fantastic magical morning and today we're gonna play another standard event trying to farm some packs and gems and it's been quite a while since I've seen you. I had a ton of final exams and I finished my thesis which kind of finished off a piece of my soul uh, but it's all done. I only had one final board exam to become a physician after six years. So yeah, I'm currently in Ireland in my fiance's house, so with that being said, let's try to make some content again. And we're gonna play some gruel, something easy, something to not hit my brain too hard. Uh, where we have some new cards, if you can call them new, have the set has been out for a while now. Uh, but first off we have Breakout, 2 mana, look at the top 6 cards. If you have a find a creature, 2 mana or less, you can put it on the battlefield with haste and you can attack right away. Pretty sweet. We do need to find some creatures. And then we have Case of the Crimson Pulse. Uh, it's a rather sweet saga that I thought was going to pop off a lot more in mono red and aggressive decks. So I guess I'll try it out now. Three mana, enter the battlefield, discard a card and draw two. Then if you have no cards in your hand, at the, then you solve it. And then you're going to draw three cards from now on. Oh, you, at the beginning of your upkeep, discard your hand, draw two cards. But you should play all your cards outright. So with that being said, you never ran out of gas, and that is essentially it. So yeah, let's not hurt my brain too much and try to get back into the game. Let's give it a go. Alright, let's get started. As always, if you have any questions about the deck or the gameplay, please don't hesitate to ask me in the comments below. You know I love to hear from you and it helps the channel out. And if you happen to enjoy the content, please give the video a like and possibly subscribe. That would make my day. Alright, let's start the first game. Alright, we get to go first, and this hand is pretty sweet. We have a lot of aggressive power. We can get open up with our scampi. And then hopefully it doesn't have cut down, because then this hand is terrible. Uh, but we'll see what Dookie96 is playing here. Get Demir. Fantastic. It's not like they have a lot of removal, but we did get another creature, which is really sweet. So we can get the Swift Spear out and try to win something. Uh, let's attack. He has a stick, so there's a cut down. I'm not gonna play into it. Sure, decline this. So he's gonna, in response to him using his cut down, we're going to use our royal treatment. Or he's playing that. Not ideal for me. Yeah, it's a squirming eminence deck. I don't know if people are still playing it. Some, you know, some people like having ketchup on their eggs every day. Okay, yeah, sure. <coughs> Hookie dookie. So, treatment on you. Because we're going to try to get... Oh, perfect, more land. Uh, let's put this on green. And we have to play Audacity now. I can put this on the Cacophony. And we attack. And we'll see how he blocks. I think we just hold real treatment. I don't think we can kill him here. 4, 8, 6, 7, 9, 10, 11. No, we can't kill him anyway. So let's go ahead and attack. Alright, so let's put the Monstrous Rage on you. And then we'll just hold the Royal Treatment to try to pr uh, protect our creatures. Oh, well, our, a creature. 10 to 10. So yeah, we're gonna decline that. And the opponent gets to go. What are you gonna do now? Turn 3. My turn 3 was pretty good. Maybe he has Squirming Emergence already, then we might be a little bit screwed. Okay, nothing. Fantastic. Tap land, love it. <laughs> this is going great. And let's just charge into this dookie. Okay, so hopefully it's hard. Yeah, it goes for the Cacophony here. Because then he has to pay for the ward, and then we just Royal Treatment, and then it's going to be... Third Triumph. Perfect. Pay the word, please. And then we just win the game. Easy. Just clap them in the head before they get a chance to do anything. <sighs> Bam. Easy. Next game. Yeah, we get to go first, and this hand is not too bad. I mean, Swift Spear, Picnic Runner, come on. Count Papa against Edu Rodriguez. Strong name, indeed. 
So whenever you're ready. Aha, here we go. So let's get you out to start poking him in the face. Pain. Let's get the lore hold sleeves too. That brings me back. Okay, so we're playing against Boros, I guess. Which is not too bad. Um uh, Picnic Runer, I think, is better than the Ruby Newbie. We keep on attacking. I think the picnic. I mean, whenever I play against Gruel and I see the picnic runner, I have to kill it. And I don't see any lightning helix, which is really good. Put this on red. So I can play you out and tap properly, please. I would like to keep my audacity. Actually, we can't. No, I picked the wrong color. That's a mistake. Uh, okay. Let's just go ahead and attack then, I suppose. Mistakes are always made. Okay, Virtue. It's fine, let's just shoot that. Pew. Yeah, I don't think Boros can really do much. I mean, this is like mid-range Boros with the Virtue of Loyalty. I don't know how they're gonna do. Okay. Give me a Warlord's Call. Well, this is just game over, isn't it? There's no way they can survive this. Uh, <laughs> no! Ruby, you are gonna attack. And we put this on you as well, since of the double uh, strike, of course. So I'm pretty sure that's what? How much damage is it? 14, 17, 20. <laughs> not too bad, not too bad at all. Next game. Another gay, another time. Gay game. And we're on the draw, not uh, not what you want to see when you're playing this stack. Uh, but we'll keep this. Swift Spear, nice. Into... Okay, Demir again. Well, we were dodging cut down in the previous game. Maybe we can dodge it again. Who knows? Let's go ahead and play you and you. I do think the Cacophony is better than Swift Spear to start off. But I'm thinking there might be a... Son of a bitch. No fun or loud. Okay, so let's get the Swift Spear out. We can attack and we can use the Monstrous Rage. Monstrous Rage. But I think I'd rather just keep the Royal Treatment because we cannot lose this. This creature has to stay alive. <laughs> we cannot have it die on me. Okay, fair enough. Let's just keep this going. You, and we put you on red. Kumano out. And we attack. See if he wants to block, probably not. We have Monstrous Rage into... It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Oh, you... Why? <laughs> it's like the deck is so aggressive, but at the same time cannot handle take any damage from your own land, and now we don't have the protection spell for our Swift Spear. That's really bad. I, to be fair, if he has a uh, Shieldred, we're pretty screwed in a way. He doesn't have Shieldred, otherwise he would have played it before attacking. It's down to 8. We better not lose... Oh, there's Shieldred. Well... How do we get out of this situation? Uh, tap you for once. See what we get here. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. <sighs> not playing this game. Shake it off, shake it off. Hey, we get to go first. It's not too bad. And yeah, let's get the Swift Spear out and we attack. Poke him in the face. Love to do that. Do -do 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 -do. Okay, so domains. We have to kill him fast. We cannot deal with a stupid Archangel of Wrath. Picnic Runer out and attack. We could have a pretty explosive turn next turn. Sure, so I'm guessing. Uh, okay, so he's holding maybe. 
He needs two mana for the uh, Spudgeon Green. He's holding two mana for the Ley Line, right? So we, I think we just play a... Uh, <laughs> we could maybe just Rage Rage and Royal Treatment and can we kill him. I'm sure he has the Ley Line. It would be nice to do Ruby, but I don't think so. I think we just go balls to the walls against this guy and just smash him so hard he poops out his teeth the following day. Question is how we do it. Rage on you, obviously. And now we're guaranteed to have Queen Mana open in case. Because uh, uh, the Thram Portal would not want to be dropped. So we have 10, 12 here. So let's just do this. <sighs> yeah, I think we put on you. We only get plus 2, but that's gonna be 14 plus 3, so that's 17. See if he wants to take those. There's no way he can take this. Oh, he's already given off the stack. Has he? No, no. It's, yeah, there it is. Right. So the game is over, right? On you. Good game. Just to be an asshole. Yep. That's how we do it. Leyland binding. Get out of here. Pawn gets to go first. Why not life? I love when you do this to me. Hand is not too bad, though. Maybe we can actually get Breakout to work fine. <laughs> Whenever the opponent is ready, that is. Four lands though, but Nagro is not the greatest, but Swift Spear, Monster Rage, we find Ruby or Picnic and just watch him burn. Whenever he's ready, that is. One eternity later. Fucking finally. <laughs> Christ almighty. M2A, you're on my shit list. Okay, we got Ruby, that's kind of cool. So we play Swift Spear out, hopefully it doesn't have much... I doesn't. He has the Aurelia sleeves. I don't know if that's anything I should deduce from. He is a bit slower than the other players, which is annoying. Okay, it's a card I thought of putting in here, but I think it's too slow. I love Questing Druid, I love the whole PNLR, Exile, play Exile cards. But it didn't work for me. So let's see if Breakout can actually work this time. Well, it's better than the... It's better than the Demir player, at least. We got nothing. Uh, we attack. See if he wants to trade with the Cacophony. Which I would not do. I think the Questing Druid is worth more. Okay. Opponent has the same idea. Decline, please. Or maybe we should have shot him. I don't know. A few moments later. Just do something. The rope is my friend. Okay, questing through it again. So do you have a shock? No, come on. Okie dokie. Not too bad. Okay, he's being a little bit aggressive too. So we definitely play you out. We don't want you tapped anymore. Put that on green. Oh, 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 no, no, you do not. There we go. And we attack. I mean, it's the most obvious monster straight. Uh huh. Guess not. And I'm choosing not to activate you again. He gets his. No, no, no. Come on, oh, flips the following turn. Turn three, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? Picnic Runer, probably the best card in this whole blue pile. Then what? Then what? Dacity, sure. Ooh, Dilali. Uh, let's play you out. Put in red. Question is, do we put the monster rage before so we can get Ruby uh, extra powered up? And I think so. I think we put this on you. And we just attack. Because this is lethal, very lethal. He has to jump. Even if he, yeah, he can't. Yeah, it's very, very, very lethal. I don't know how he's going to get out of it. 
Oops. It's not oops. Don't be a, don't be a douche. I'm falling asleep here. Oops, my butthole. Whenever you want, dude. It really doesn't require that much thinking. You block or you don't. He's there. He's just... you, Man, thinking? I don't know, man. You have three brain cells. He has to actually activate the other one. What is he... Four, seven, take four more because Cacophony dies. Okay. What is going on here? <laughs> All right. Well, it did take a long time. So you get to be a one life. Well, for once, good game. Really? I mean, it wasn't. It was a long game. A long game playing two aggro decks against each other. It shouldn't be this long. Okay, did you kick it? Yeah, I did. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Attacks with one. We are and we are flooding here as well. A good game, a good game. Take my land. I hope you looped up. Good game. Get out of here. You really thought he had me, huh? I have no words. Just. Okay, opponent gets to go first again. We are not that lucky in these matchups. I swear, there's something with it. We're keeping the hand, obviously. We do have some breakout. Maybe finally breakout becomes good. So, blue. Azori's control on the draw. Uh, it's not Azori's control, it's Azori's soldiers. I thought that deck species was definitely gone. Uh, Kumano's pretty good too. I think we go with Ruby here into Kumano. Yeah. And then we'll have form on the next turn. We can break out plus Picnic Runer. Wonder what Hunky Harry is playing. Like, well, nobody's playing what he has in his hand. Cannot do two things at the same time. Okay, Audacity is pretty cool. Get Capulsion Force out. Runer or Breakout. Well, one is gonna be a Breakout regardless. But Pigna Runer is coming out naturally. And we play, uh, uh, we could... No, I think we save the attack to the following turn. Well, we have to take another Picnic Runer. Yes, I'd like to take action. We're not attacking, though. Next turn, we can have a pretty big attack. We're two putting out Audacity and Monstrous Rage. And if you find a land, we'll play at uh, the other breakout. Hunky Harry, you better, you know. Azorius is so last year. Azorius, uh, soldiers. As uh, soldiers. <laughs> Funny. Sure. I'm so hungry. Okay. Well then, we're gonna have... We play this out, because this is going to activate both the other Picnic Runer plus Ruby, right? So I think we put this on you, because it will have double, double, double strike and trample. And then we're going to put the other Monster's Rage onto the other Picnic Runer. I don't think we need this out, but fuck it. Let's go ahead and attack. So he's going to definitely block Picnic Runer. He's not going to take 8 damage, and then we put the Monster's Rage on the other Picnic Runer. And uh, yeah, watch him trouble, because he doesn't have trample, right? Alright. So we Monster's Rage, I think he's pretty dead here. We're going to take 3, 6... Yeah, it's a lot of damage. Because even if it makes it indestructible here, it's still going to take... Yeah, it absorbs 4 damage and that's it. It's going to take 4, 7, plus 12. So that's exactly lethal. 
It ain't a bad. Well, maybe there's something to this deck. I thought it was going to be a joke, but it's pretty cool. Okie dokie. That was a pretty fast event and we got six wins. And honestly, I just want to play Gruul for something fun to get back into the game. And it was better than I thought. So we can see about the deck. We do need to make some changes. We were only 22 lands, but we somehow got flooded in a couple of games. So I want to cut a case and also the breakouts are not that good. We tried. Uh, but I'd rather just play with Lightning Strike, I think. So let's get that down. And what else would we do want? I mean, the case was good, but... When you get more than one, it's not that fun. But it does work when it works. And yeah, we could do something like this or put more play with fires. And yeah, it's a very, very fun deck to play. I mean, it's powerful, it's fast. And I think I'm gonna play some more ranked as well because I'm getting kind of sick with the standard events. Um, I am simply and I'm gonna try to do recordings with my face on if you have enjoyed this video please let me know in the comments below and with that being said thanks so much for watching till the end you rock like and subscribe and have a good fucking day